Yo, what's up guys, I'm Texbo back with another video. I know it's been a while since I made a video, it's been like three or four months. Um, I just haven't been feeling YouTube recently. I just haven't been feeling Black Ops 3. Black Ops 3 just isn't that fun for me at the moment. I mean, it's fun whenever I'm playing GBs, but I'm sure you guys don't want to see GBs or anything like that, or Black Ops 3 in general. Um, but I just want to let you guys know that I will be doing YouTube again. I am back, um, so sorry for the absence. Um, I might be taking a few days off every like day or so just because I have work and stuff like that. But anyways, I want to talk about what's been what's going to be happening tomorrow. Um, MLG Anaheim. MLG Anaheim. The the pools are Group A Optic, Cloud9, TSM. Group B, Rise, H2K, 100 Thieves, Group C, Phase, Elevate, Luminosity, Group D, Envy, Dream Team, and Complexity. I think Optic, Rise, Phase, and Envy are going to be the top four teams at this event in that order too. Uh, it's kind of funny, I don't know why. I just think Optic's going to win the event. They've been looking dominant in this game. I don't see why they wouldn't win the event, honestly. So, I think Optic's going to end up winning this event. For, I just just the way that they've been playing in black ops 3 they just look so dominant they look almost unstoppable um they've had a little bit of a rough rough start during um the beginning of season 2 i believe um they had like uh, it was kind of iffy there but um rise rise has been looking really good they won two of the five tournaments held in black ops 3 they won totinos and then umg um i'm not sure what the event was i know it's a umg something um they won that though optic came in second at totinos and then in um i think at the umg event they came in like seventh place or something like that so it's a little bit of a bummer for them but i mean they've been uh winning the last three tournaments um honestly with ease too uh Especially ESWC, ESWC was, they had a rough day on Friday, but Saturday and Sunday, they just blew the competition out of the water. None of the games looked close. If you ask me, um, it was just all Optic that uh, Sunday. So ESWC, Optic took that one pretty easily. Um, what was the other one in Australia? I'm not sure what the one in Australia was called. Um, I think it was the Crown Invitational. Crown Invitational, Optic won that, um, and then I'm not sure what the the one before that was. Oh, Stage 1 Finals, Stage 1 Finals, Optic won that, um, beat Rise 5-5, that was a really good match, um, amazing, Game 5, Round 11, it was awesome, Rise held a pretty good comeback, they came back uh, two maps straight, played Optic in the third map, um, Optic went to 5-5 with them, and... The reason why they lost that is probably because Looney didn't use his heat wave. Um, Formal killed him before he did. Anyways, you guys probably seen it, but that was a really good, really, really good match between Optic and Rise. So that's why I'm expecting Optic and Rise to be in Grand Finals in Animal G Anaheim, just because they're the best teams in the game right now. Phase, they just haven't proven that they're the most dominant team. I mean, they just they won a 25k, but that was really that. That's all that came from them this year. They haven't been making any other noise. Envy, they just formed this new team. Um, they beat Optic last night in their uh, CWL match, but um, Optic didn't. From what I heard, Optic didn't have headsets or anything like that. They were playing from the sounds of the monitor, and they were all in Las Vegas. So, and I, I believe Envy's um, East Coast too. So, or or Central. I'm not too sure. I'm not too sure where they're from, but. Um, it was just an unfair match for both both teams, so we'll see what happens on LAN. Um, I honestly think Optic's more dominant on LAN than on um, online, honestly. I think everyone thinks that. But we'll see what happens in MLG Anaheim. I'm really excited to see it. I really hope that Optic and Rise are in the finals. Maybe Optic and FaZe. I don't know, FaZe, just, they just have to come out. And they just have to play really, really good. They haven't been doing anything in Black Ops 3, as I just said. So, if they do get to Grand Finals, um, it's going to be pretty crazy to see how they do it. Um, you know, but we'll, we'll see what happens. I really want to see uh, an Optic and Rise um, Grand Final, though. 
Um, I'm not sure about Envy. I'm not sure if I want to see Optic and Envy in Grand Final. It would be a classic, but I'm not sure. Um, the best teams in the game that would be the best to see, you know, the rivalry of Black Ops 3, Optic and Rise. So far, I really want to see that match. Um, just to see who the better team is on LAN. And, you know, have a fair LAN, kind of like Stage 1. But, you know, we just, we got to make sure who the better team is. I know Optic won Stage 1, but you never know. Rise may win MLG Anaheim. I personally think Optic's going to win it. Um, I just don't have any doubt in my mind that Optic's gonna win MLG Anaheim. I don't know why they just They look dominant ever since Advanced Warfare They look pretty dominant in Advanced Warfare, but they look even better in this game And I'm really excited to see what they can do in MLG Anaheim um, Yeah, I'm really excited to see that MLG Anaheim it hasn't been played since COD Ghost two years. It's been MLG Anaheim has always been one of the more popular events, and I'm really excited to see that event again. Um, Ghost MLG Anaheim was pretty much when I started watching competitive and playing it. I was like, yo, I want to do that. I want to I want to play competitive. Tried it. So far, it hasn't worked out, but I mean, it's not going to happen in a snap of a finger. So we'll see what happens. Um, I did move. I have moved from my last location. I now have better internet really good internet so i can start live streaming and stuff like that i live streamed in the past just i'm um, not sure why i haven't been doing it recently i just again haven't felt like playing anything um that people would watch uh there's better streamers anyways like i don't like i don't want to like put myself down like that but um not a lot of people watch smaller channels and the only way to grow is just to keep doing it but i just haven't had motivation to do streaming or youtube videos recently um, I got a job, so I've been pretty busy with that, trying to buy better equipment. I am buying a scuff next Friday, so I'm excited for that. That's probably when I'll start making videos a lot more, especially in Call of Duty. Um, I might be starting up some Division games, uh, GTA, uh, we'll see what happens. Maybe a Borderlands 2 series or something like that. I love Borderlands 2. Let me know what you guys think, what game do you guys want to see me play. I can play Battlefield, all that good stuff. Just let me know what videos you what videos you guys want to see me make, and I will try my best to make them. Um, I want to hear what you guys think, though, of MLG Anaheim. Who do you guys think is going to win the tournament? Who do you guys think is there going to be an upset with Optic? Is Optic going to lose? Are they going to come up short, fifth? Who knows? Um, just like last year, Cloud Champs, everyone expected them to win, but they didn't. They came up short. Um... You know, that might happen again this year. We'll see. I'm really excited to know. Or just to see the event. Honestly, MLG Anaheim is probably my favorite event. Aside from X Games and COD Champs, obviously. COD XP at the end of the year, too. That's going to be really fun to watch. Can't wait for that. Optic won the last COD XP. And the way they're looking now, they might be winning another one, guys. So, let me know what you guys think. Who do you guys think is going to win MLG Anaheim? I personally think it's Optic just because they just look like the better team out of anyone. And they've been proving it throughout every LAN pretty much on the game. So, yeah, that's about it for me today, guys. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments below. And I will see you guys on the next one. Have a good day. And adios.